is Amanda from Shift Recovery by Acorn. I'm the program coordinator here and I'm also a recovering food addict. And as we've promised, this is kind of a three-part video series. Uh, today I'm going to talk about uh, eating disordered or an emotional eater and what the solution is for that. So uh, just to recap, uh, we kind of put people with food eating issues into three paradigms and there's lots of cro crossover and it's not as clean as this. but. This is kind of a simple way to talk about it. So there's the normal eater that struggles with weight issues. They're the eating disordered or um, emotional eater, and then there's the food addict. So today we're talking about the eating disordered. So with someone that's eating disordered or an emotional eater, basically they're eating over what's eating them. They're eating over emotions. Uh, past trauma often comes up. And what these folks need to learn is how to, a new way to deal with life, a new way to deal with their emotions. And so this looks like therapy, counselors, support groups, psychologists, they might as well need uh, the education that a normal eater has, like calories in, calories out, but they first have to deal with the emotional. They first must deal with what's going on for them. And, and as I said, it's often past trauma. So once they deal with that part, that's their main part, then they might take a look at um, getting educated about food and exercise. So the issue here is mental, emotional. Sometimes it's also physical. So the solution is mental, emotional, as in support counselors, um, and, uh, and then possibly physical as well, which is uh, calories in, calories out. So basically a supportive network. So if you're somebody that has been in therapy, been in support groups, as well as tried calories in, calories out, diet, and you're still struggling, this might not be your category either. You might be bumped over into the food addicted category. So, which we'll talk about in the next video. So again, recap, normal eater with food, with weight issues is calories in, calories out. Eating disordered, it's a mental emotional problem, so it needs a mental emotional solution first. Looking at what's eating you, looking at dealing with your feelings. And support in your life.